Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing, but you guys know what time it is. We're going to be talking about none other than Caspa itself. If you're enjoying these Caspa updates, do smash that like button and hit that red subscribe button as it does go a long, long way. So looking across the market, you know, we're seeing the market absolutely killing it right now. We're seeing quite a bit of green across the board, exactly what we've been anticipating over the course of the last few updates. Um, you know, really things have started to heat up after the FOMC meeting and, you know, the rate cut announcement was made. You can really see that, you know, the excitement is definitely being felt right now. A lot of coins up right now across the board, and I'm sure a lot of people are excited, but as far as cash by is concerned it still hasn't budged right now and of course a lot of people within the caspa community are probably wondering why is the price of caspa not seeing explosive moves uh, you know while you are seeing uh, bitcoin heading towards that confirmation level that i've been speaking about myself and um, you know bitcoin uh, is having a lot of uh, traction on its side um, and a lot of coins are feeling the love but caspa is seeing a little bit of a lag but you know i was um, you know, talking to the community members some people have good speculation regarding what could possibly be the reason and i'm going to share that with you but before we do that as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so 17.2 cents is the price down about 0.2 percent in both bitcoin and usd comparative market cap is at about 4.25 billion and the 24-hour trading volume is at about 58 million dollars but looking at the bitcoin dominance index right now you guys can see bitcoin dominance index is going down a little bit um and you know this is honestly a huge um catalyst as to why you're seeing a lot of coins actually outpacing bitcoin but imagine what would happen if the dominance goes back down you know to the 55 percent or you know some of the levels we haven't seen since last year if that were to happen i do believe altcoins will go crazy and you know the highly anticipated altcoin season i think begins then Looking at Bitcoin, though, you guys can see exactly what we've been having, you know, having a discussion revolving around, you know, Bitcoin breaking towards the confirmation zone, which is at $64,000 for myself. And you can see this for yourself after the FOMC meeting, you know, Bitcoin is trending towards the upside. And you can see this clearly. Um, and right now we're getting to that confirmation key resistance. We might see a little bit of a choppy, um, you know, level around that because, of course, that's it's a resistance. But if that is able to clear out, I do believe a $70,000 Bitcoin could be a clear target upcoming next. So, now, you know, as far as Bitcoin is concerned, you know, looking absolutely amazing. Um, just a quick reminder, if you picked up BTC at the beginning of the month, um, at September the 6th, while there was so much bloodbath across the border at $53,000, you are up right now about 21%. Looking at Caspa right now, you guys can see Caspa once again did actually end up seeing a wick all the way up to that 17.7 .7 cents mark. Of course, um, just having a little bit of a hard time remaining back above that key resistance. And I continuously have been telling you guys since last month as to how important this level really is for Caspa. And I'm sure at this point, anyone that understands what's going on can really see the bigger picture and all also understand why that specific price level is so so important as you guys can see we're about to retest that key resistance once again hopefully we do turn into support uh, but as of now yes we're seeing a little bit of a lag against um, you know the broader market compared to caspa so you know, obviously, if we're able to break out of this key resistance, I do believe uh, if we do see that close and that close is very important. Tomorrow's Friday. You now, obviously, on Friday, um, you know, we're going to see that weekly candle close. Um, if that does happen going into the weekend, I do believe, um, you know, Caspa could make its way up to the 38.2, which we haven't seen since August the 2nd. So almost, almost two months uh, ago. And again, if you want to look at these targets, if you want to look at all time highs you know, in order for Caspa to hit an all time high, high it's only a move of about 21 percent and we have seen in the past caspa making these types of significant moves quite fast but as of now the hurdle is still in front of caspa uh, which is of course at the 17.2 cents more and if you are a holder you don't want to be ignoring this and again a lot of people are talking in the community that um you know krc 20 meme coins are the reason why you know caspa is lagging because people are swapping their caspa for some of these meme coins are we about to see a meme coin season occurring obviously as of now um you know we haven't really seen any decentralized exchanges um you know on caspa you know these massive protocols 
launch but i think that could change in the near future but let me know down below what you guys think about this love each and every one of you guys we'll see you tomorrow in crypto zx and peace